Welcome back, everyone. Brian Gottlieb from Arena Decklist. We are attempting to dumpster Golos today. Our first attempts, not so great. But we got a new deck to work with now. We're moving on to Grixis Knights. And I like the mix of aggression and disruption this deck provides. Post board, we get access to the good blue spells Disdainful Stroke, Aether Gust, alongside Drill Bit. Maybe this is enough to finally dumpster Golos. Let's play the games, let's find out. Three games of Grixis Knights coming your way. Eevee Lone, thank you for the sub. You are dope. Appreciate you. I hope this Grixis Knights deck delivers for you. This deck does look very good, I agree. This is the one I'm excited about. We saved the best for last, hopefully. Although, what we, we've gone 2-1 with both decks thus far, right? Or did I just blank out a lot of what happened with the blue-red deck? No, we went 2-1. Need to play a Mythic to meet Golos decks? I mean, we've played against 50% Golos decks thus far. Snook, we are listening to... Light him up for Metal Slug 3. How do you not know this classic? Everybody knows Light him up. We can't keep this, right? This doesn't do a whole lot. Much better. Can never cast the Ember Cleave under any circumstances. It's a shame because it looks quite good here. We just keep it and pitch this watery grave. Oh, it does work to cast Ember Cleave. Okay, sweet. I was thinking of the Royal Circle. Nice. Yeah, yeah. We'll we'll get rid of this swamp. That seems fine. I'm not supposed to lead on Falmire Knight, right? It seems like you want to get the two for one there. Unless we're just going to curve out into Embercleave, and then I definitely want to leave on Follow My Knight. Right Three mana is a lot, too. Let's get our beatdown on. Breeding pool, nice. I wanted to reply, good game. What's wrong with me? Like, seriously, what's wrong with me? Why do I want to do that to people? It's not a nice thing to do. I'm a pretty nice person. But my first instinct was to hit good game. I need help. Growth spiral. Very nice. Are we cleaving? Might be cleaving. Might be good times.
Stalky Stalky. Nice, that's actually a pretty good draw in this spot. Alright, we're just jamming Embercleave here. Alley -oop. I don't want this to be a so close yet so far game. That would break my heart. Oh, we can beat that. Yeah, scoop him up. Dumpstered, next. Or I guess the same. But still. That felt nice. That was a dumpster ring. A legitimate dumpster ring. So. Those are the six cards that really stand out to me. I don't think you want Noxious Grasp or Aether Gust. Those are just for different matchups. You gotta find cuts, though. That's probably a tough part here. So I think it's hard to get wide against all the sweepers, so I don't think Spent and Sword Master is particularly good. Foulmire Knight also is a downgrade, so maybe like this seems okay. Yeah, Drill Bit and St Stroke are the six cards we really want to bring in. This other stuff doesn't seem worth it to me. I don't know if you're supposed to cut Royal Scions. Maybe like two sword masters is better than four scions. Cut light up and reaper, strong disagree. Strong disagree. Maybe you have enough card advantage where you can just like go on a grindy plan. Alright, don't think we can keep this. Not great. Keepable though. Uh, probably bidding this Ember Cleave. It's fine. Our deck has evasion in the form of Death Touch plus Ember Cleave. The greatest form of evasion. Awesome. Just how we drew it up. Is that cardboard live link that pops up? That actually works? So I can get rid of this command if that's the case. Nice. Cardboard live's great. Shout out to my friends over at Cardboard Live. Alright, I assume we're just end stepping a paragon here. Not working for y'all. Alright, I take back that praise cardboard live. Do better. That's a shame. Can copy from the extension, can copy from the website link. Huh. 
Yeah, old cardboard live dumpster in. How techy. I mean, it doesn't make any sense at all, but how techy. Doesn't work on mobile. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, is this our turn or opponent's turn? I've, I've lost track of the game. I literally don't know whose turn it is. It's mine. Okay. That's not an important detail, right? Not something I should be paying attention to. about light up the stage here. I can still play Evan Legion if I want to get a little wider. I'm going to play Knight of the Ebon Legion. Next turn I can go Fervent Champion Rimrock Knight. Even if we get swept here. That way if he plays Golos I'm not just dead. Counters. All stream titles are a bait. You missed it, Max Elmer. I told everyone. Don't trust anyone who's on the other side of a screen from you. They're always selling you something. But I'm glad you're here. Thank you for coming. Our decks are okay. This deck seems pretty good. I don't want to lose this castle locked away. It's a little awkward that we can't play champion and Rimrock Knight activation, but I think it's worth it. Beanstalk Giant. No Golos. Double Beanstalk Giant? It's a little weird. Sky Tether! Get him! Well, it mostly feels like we can't win anymore. Gonna cast a Loctwain as opposed to Rimrock Knight. I don't know if that accomplishes anything, but. Feels like we are just mostly dead at this point. I don't really know what we're supposed to do. Yeah, I'm comfortable just scooping here, actually. Right. Is there a way to push through death type damage here? I don't think so. I'll take my draws. Okay, now I will. If they had no lands, no spells, the rest of the game, you could win. I often feel that way when playing against Golos. Like, if they don't do anything ever again, there's a small chance I can pull it out. It's a very small chance, though. I don't think anything was wrong with our sideboarding. Setup still seems fine.
Our draw wasn't that bad. We probably win that game on the play. Ugh. This is actually pretty palatable given given the one land nature. A little flute remix? Nice. Just hoping to get a flute remix today. Oh, we're definitely keeping. This is I mean this is a fine hand. I don't think there's any problem with this. Been this drill bit or the Royal Scions? Probably Royal Scions. Look up. Hold on. How do I? How do I point? Ah. Ah. Top right corner is generally what you're looking for, and I'll give you the song. Opponent's got a head scratcher here. Or arena exploded. Also a possibility. This is Zelda Heineken, The Legend of Zelda, Matthias Holmgren, Remix Info at OCR. Overclock Remix. All the music coming from rainwave.cc because they are dope. They do not sponsor me. It's just a cool site. Opponent, are you okay over there? I'm worried about you. I really want to play this game out. I don't want you to disappear. Oh. I don't know if opponent's here or not. Are you there, opponent? It's me, Brian. Oh, we have so many thoughts on field getting banned with the BNR announcement being moved up. I'm not saying any of them out loud. But there's so many thoughts up here right now. How was Demir midrange deck performing? Better than I expected, but I don't believe it's actually a good deck. Are we talking about it on Arena Decklist? No. We recorded Arena Decklist this morning. Well, we played perfectly there. Crap, I really wanted to play that match. Yeah, put him in the dumpster. Another confirmed dumpster entrant. Let's open a pack. I'm feeling frisky. What do we got? This is just going to be gems. Yeah, not very exciting. These have to be close to gems at this point. Yeah, Javier showed up to play that. That go around. Castle Ardenvale. Another Lock Mirror Serpent. Just what everyone needs. Four Lock Mirror Serpents. Perfect. Next game. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I'll let you boy. Getting a little laggy as Arena. That makes sense. I only have a brand new $3,500 gaming computer. You can't expect it to run a program like Arena. Pretty clear keep. 
I really don't know how to answer this Fal Falmire Knight question. It seems like I'm supposed to be playing it. Goose is loose. So stupid. <laughs> I was like, oh, I'll play this fervent champion and I'll be able to to rimrock knight. Well, I guess this still pushes through a little extra damage. And I am gonna play the Smitten Sword Master as well. Oh, couldn't risk it. This Oko. Feels like the answer is never, ever yes. Maybe I could have if I didn't waste that Smitten Sword Master. I will not be taking any questions on if Field gets banned presently. Just because they've lost their damn minds doesn't mean we all have to. It just feels so bad. Like, what are we supposed to do there? Attack Oko and give it 5 damage to bring it to 1. And then next turn it makes a 3-3 three, three anyway. Like that. I just don't get it. Play Royal Scions plus on Fervent Champion, then everything trades with the token. And I push through four. Have Rumor Up Knight for the next turn. Or I can make the same play with Rumor Up Knight and then play Smitten Sword Master. I think that's a little better. I can't quite put my finger on why. I guess the extra body on the battlefield, and also I might get a good block from the Fervent Champion. Oh, can this not cast the Adventure side? That'll make me very sad. It definitely can't. Now I'm sad.
But I will tell you, this card is miserable to play against playing any kind of aggressive deck. How do we push through this last damage? First strike two. Come on. RTFC. Wow, this uh, this deck really stacks the deck against us. I think we can probably just scoop to that. So, the only card that mattered was Oko. Like, that single-handedly beat the entire strategy. Gust. God, I would love if they banned all planeswalkers. Uh, there's been a fair amount of dumpstering, a fair amount of getting dumpstered. It's a pretty even dumpster exchange at this point. Trying to think like what cards are bad against Oko, and the answer is all of them. I don't really know what to cut, so I'm just trimming things indiscriminately. My Reaper's probably pretty medium. I don't think there'll ever be a set without Planeswalkers again. Unfortunately.
block stuff here. Someone is at my door, but it's literally impossible for there to be someone at my door that I care about. There, there just can't be. My dog's name is Kai. And he's great. He's old, but he's great. Oko, do we just scoop? We just pack it up, right? Oh, Bone Crusher Giant. That's pretty horrible, too. Do I have a moat? No, I should get one. I don't have roommates. My wife's kind of my roommate. Does that count? Oh, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, that card. That card. Can't beat it. Under any circumstances. Smashing into this problem head on. I hope that some solution eventually presents itself. It doesn't. Elks. Okay. It's decent at least. I just can't ever if I like ever attack this planeswalker, I can't win. But I can't win if it's on the battlefield, either. So frustrating. Like, I could have grasped it, but... Wh where does that leave me? But then I'm completely stonewalled by this... 4-4 four -four on the battlefield. Like, I think the only way I possibly win is if I get ultra-wide and can smit and sword master them out. I don't know, maybe I do just grasp it. And then I just sit there. Murderous Rider, not in the deck, I don't think. Right? Three mana too much. It is a knight. Correct. <laughs> no, don't tap my red mana. Why would you, why would you do that? Just why? Fine. 
It's a world where this Ember Cleave is actually good enough, but alongside this Rimrock Knight, but not this world. Thanks, Dex. I'm glad you enjoyed the article. It was a fun one to write. How goes the beating of the Golos? We did beat Golos with this deck, surprisingly. But you can't beat Oko ever. And now we're pretending like this is actually some kind of meaningful game. It's not. It's not a meaningful game. Like we're just dead. We can't we can't win from this position. It's not realistic. Maybe we grasp Oko and there's a chance. I do think I misplayed. Like, I certainly should have grasped Oko. It is a card that very much obscures your path to victory because none of your options feel good anymore. Yoko's got us. Crooked Hat is a New York thing. I have no idea. It just feels more comfortable when it's not on straight. Oh, the nuts. This is the last game with our last deck, Alex Vaz. Sorry. There'll be VODs. There'll be videos of the individual decks on the YouTube page, though. So don't worry about it. You can catch up. All right, now we get to test our dumpster in abilities. I'm trying to think if there's a way we could get Knight of the Ebon Legion to activate, but there is not. Crooked Hat is a gang thing. That was, that's, that's dumb. That's just dumb. Yeah, I do have a video with my new Bant Golos list. Over on the YouTube page. Just like Rimrock Knight here. That's uh, gotta be champion. Rimrock Knight is better on the next turn. Glad you're enjoying it, Evie Lone. That makes me happy. For sure. I just want to play Rimrock Knight here. What is... what... Uh, oh, oh. What happened? What? Oh boy. <laughs> Am I missing something? Oh, it's a fairy. Come on! 
God, I hate these fucking planeswalkers. You actually might see me cry due to planeswalkers on, on this stream. I've just had it, like... Uh, can we stop? Can we just stop? Can we stop with the three mana planeswalkers? Please, please, please. I don't want to do this anymore. You have broken me, Teferi. This is it. This is me breaking. You have, you've done it. You've broken me. I have nothing left. I'm going to cast my knights, sadly, and wait for them to die. And wait for this long, hellish, standard nightmare to be over. I have nothing left. I've got time. Nothing left. There's just nothing left. Wait till three mana Elspeth. Yeah, I cannot wait. Can't wait for that card. I can't even cast my fucking Ember Cleave. Ah! And I missed the Fervent Champion. <sighs> okay. Okay. It's okay. I'm just, uh, I'm just never going to play Magic again. <laughs> that's, that's the correct solution for all of this. Pleated plants, don't be nice to me right now. I don't need that. No, I'm sorry. I do need that. Thank you, pleated plants. Pleated pants, I appreciate the sub. You are great. Teferi is not. Oh, I missed my night activation. I, I just, I don't, I don't know anymore, y'all. Dolos, yeah! Woo! I was hoping this card would come down. The good news is I played like such a dingus, our opponent can't possibly put me on Embercleave. Oh, I'm broken. I, I, I let y'all know. That is it. I got nothing left. Can't play this fervent champion anymore. That's sweet. I'd like this to get plus one out. How dare you block that fervent champion? How dare you, sir? One cleaving, please. We're definitely dead, right? Can't activate Golos. I can't move my cleave over to Knight of the Ebon Legion. No double white for Wrath. Well, maybe we just play Fallmire Knight here. Tap land would be very nice. 
Ah, second field. Perfect. Nice, Agent of Treachery. Take my Embercleave. I wasn't using it. Please, help yourself. Oh, you're just going to take the knight, huh? Well, that's interesting. Yeah, they're a mana short of moving it off. I think that's okay, though. Like, I, I think they're just dead in this scenario, right? Like, maybe they can stay alive. I don't think so, though. I haven't done any math. I'm just arbitrarily attacking. Just dead. Dumpster cleaved. Love it. Right, let's go this first, and then this. Weird. Yep, 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 yep. Looks good to me. <laughs> Slap everyone around, Knight of the Evan Legion. Uh, yeah. I, I don't think this deck works. I mean, I think as long as Oko is a card. Are you supposed to play like Sorceress Spyglass? What was that? I don't even know what that was. What did we do last time? I think we split like this. I was pretty happy with it. Something like that. Leyline of Okos? I would play that card. Shit. Angrath's Rampage in this side? Okay. It's pretty good. I mean, we have these Noxious Grasps. It's just as soon as you play Oko, it's like, already gotten so much value. Ripping up the ladder with my new Golos list. I want to play my new Golos list. Why have I been sentenced to this hellscape of non-Golos decks? I'm not good at magic. I need a stupid broken deck. If y'all haven't picked that up by now, I'm a deck builder, a deck selector. That is what I'm good at. And then I'll punt away games all day. But if I have by far the best deck, I can mask that. Embercleave is good in this deck. There has to be a better Embercleave deck. I don't know. There's a lot of Death Touchers in this deck. I mean, that's that's the big interaction. New Golos list over on YouTube. YouTube.com slash Arena Deck Lists. Don't want to miss that one. How is this deck versus Oko Golos? Probably terrible. What I want to do here. I think just like force damage with Rimrock Knight, hold up disdainful stroke slash paragon is the way to go. 
Do I think Okogolis is better than not Okogolis? No. I think Okogolis is bad. Very bad. Our, our episode of the podcast this week is a deep dive on Golos. And we talk about that quite a bit. No! No, Tulsimir. Get gone. Done with you, Tulsimir. Woo! Royal Scions? Royal Scions seems good. They should have a Wrath this turn. Could go Rimrock Knight. Now, Royal Science maximizes our mana. I'm cool with that. Royal Science at the drill bit might get the job done. Oh no. All of these cards are very good. I think the worst one is actually Tulsimir? Yeah, that's surprising, but I, I do think that's the worst one. Real Science does a nice job of pressuring there zombie tokens here. Red source could be sick. Go los. Can't get another field, right? Play to land. Howling Mine Effects plus Discord card, sort of a Nambo, sort of. I kind of agree. Drillbit's supposed to take the key card, though. But there is a problem where, like, all their cards are key cards, right? Damn, we couldn't find one red land. Can we force lethal? I don't think so. We can get close. Get real close. So I force two damage or four damage. assume I will be time wiped this turn so I want access to another paragon activation. Royal Scion's ult starting to be a little bit of a threat. What you got? Land, land, land. That's what you get for playing 30 lands in your deck. Take it, Golos. Hope you learned your lesson.
GG. Pack it up. No, we'll probably still lose. Dumpstering is complete. Yeah, this deck was good. I like this deck. I do think Oko is a huge problem. So you gotta figure that one out if you're going to play Grixis Knights, but that was pretty impressive. Why do I get so many packs all the time? Is this just what happens? Do you just get given all these packs? And orbs? Hashtag blessed. Renewal rewards. Okay. I feel like I already got those. First 25 levels have a bunch of extra packs. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. Um, that's it. We're done. Nothing dumpsters. Nothing dumpsters. Okay. Or nothing dumpsters. Golos. Like that. That was fine. I don't even know that we're a huge favorite. If your deck is built to contemplate these things, I do think Golos has an advantage, and they will continue to refine the deck throughout Standard for as long as they are allowed to participate in it. Unmoored Ego is very bad against Golos. It actually does not matter at all. Would not recommend playing that card. Just like Ashiok, also bad against Golos. Just meaningless. So... I don't know if we found our dumpster in solution. Yeah, I did hear the BNR news. My head has exploded thoroughly. Uh, and that is the last I will say about it. But I do appreciate y'all coming in for this stream. Y'all are awesome. And we will do this again sometime soon. Bye for now. <laughs>